all right okay all right welcome back to boss boss games man i ain't your host boss all right so last we left off on man uh <laughs> we already know this man nick is about to turn we already know <laughs> it, it, it hints at it, it how can i say they hints at it a lot in this game <laughs> that's why i think that's why the cops shot uh probably shot max and drugged the girl and then shot the the creature that was like running through that room and stuff because if you get bit you're affected and then you turn i mean you saw that with nick nick was like hey man uh you smell hella good like i want to eat you <laughs> so but anyway guys i hope your day is going pretty good please like and subscribe to the channel that helped me out a lot please comment down below let me know what other games that i should play all right let's get to it all right yeah, because I wasn't able to rescue Nick. I wonder if I didn't kiss. Of course, that food to kiss somebody. Maybe maybe he would have survived and stuff. But, all right, let's look around real quick before we go talk to Nick. Is there anything in this toilet? Here. At least flash your phone. I wonder how you take a picture or something. Cause now they're saying, hey, take a picture for the evidence and stuff for the cops. So, I'm pretty sure at the end, the cops going to be like, so what happened? Hold up, you want some tall people? <laughs> hey, hold up real quick. Yeah, I had to fix my, fix my seat real quick so I could be comfortable. There you go. What the heck? Hold up. End of the line, homie. Why every time I look at her, I'm, I just think about Alice. <laughs> Alice Dumpy. Is there anything in here? I feel like it should be a car or something up in here. It's a shower. It says because I lost the freaking gun, yo. The only thing that sucks about it, I lost the freaking gun. This place was so different like 12 hours ago. You don't want to show your homeboys and stuff? I would have showed them evidence, bro. I would have been like, all right, y'all, y'all see this? Uh, we need to get the hell out of here, bro. I think we should have ran, dude. I went and told Nick, hey, man, you know you're about to turn. I better. Thanks. I'm be talking about, man, you smell good. I'm gonna be like, what you mean? <laughs> uh, look at, dude, look at his face, bro. I mean, look at his face. It's like he's starving. Yeah, go talk to his squad. Oh, talk to nobody. What is that? What is I was supposed to look? The X. Oh, I think I see it. it's like great. That X. Hmm. I can't find. Oh. Um. I don't. I don't see anything. I don't see anything in the bathroom. Check every bathroom. Check those, uh... Check over here. I think I went over here yet. Oh, here we go. Here. Oh. Okay. 
That's it. I don't know if we're gonna survive, but here we go. I wonder where Caleb is. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like a... He was like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. You know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit, or scratched, or whatever. He just kept moving around, like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Mm, rabies? He's not frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. Yeah, isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, yeah. But I think it's more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like... Like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Abby? Yeah? Can I ask you something? Of course. Like me. Oh, I don't know what's going on with you, but uh, this is his last moments. That means Emma, uh, Emma's bitten too, so she ain't gonna survive Nick. either. Please just tell me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. That's such a, oh, such a. Such what? Such a cop out answer. <sighs> Abby? Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Uh, yeah. Okay. Why don't you like me, Abby? Oh my Jesus! Try to be. Comp Let me. I I'll just speak about his last Nick, word. I do like you. No, no, you don't. You don't like me at all, do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. God, I sure know how to pick on. What? You're not really very smart, are you? Stupid Abby. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I... <gasps> Whoa. Whoa, Abby. Abby, everything okay? Holy shit. Yep, I'm gonna shoot you. If I shot him, he would kill him so he could stay out of it. Oh, man. I thought he was going to kill Abby, bro. So. Emma about to turn two, so. Emma's on.
fuck is that? Okay, so if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters, I would go to the lodge. Man, this sucks. I always am, do if. If I didn't get bit because of the quick events and stuff, if I didn't get bit, I think I would have been. But no. But let's look around real quick. Ryan's hmm. stories again. I had no idea kids were getting freaked out about this stuff. We officially suck as counselors. Ooh, letter from home. Let me see what they say. Yeah, but that wrote some of the. Sorry, not the... So I'm guessing they was getting upset for him telling those ghost stories. And stuff. At the same time, it's like line up, kids. You know, line up a little bit. And that sucks. Well, you want one last beer before we go? <laughs> Cause I did not know that. Cause now, yeah, they said the once you get cut, like bit or anything, like it disappeared. Your scratch disappeared, and I knew Nick was gonna change cause he got bit already. So that means Matt's got bit too, so he would have changed too. Gotta get out of here. Let me see something real quick. Another thing I looked up to. If I could find it. Half? Oh. No. Okay, here we go. It's a can it's a it's a map. Okay. Ours is way over here. Crazy. It's like it feels like a big ass game, honestly. But they did a, a excellent job with this game. Stuff. I guess we'll go there then. I do not want to go that way. Oh, Jesus. I'm going back, yo. <laughs> oh, hell no. I just saw the homeboy just leaked his ass right there. It's time for me to go back. Go back this way. There's another path I saw, too. Ah, oh, never mind. I have to go that way. Oh, I don't want this way. Another path right here. I saw. Go this way. Safe. Hey, this bugs do so hell, dude. This is why I do not want to go camping again. They're watching up here. Try not to be scared, but I guess this is the scariest part of the game right here. In the woods by yourself, nowhere else. All because of stupid Jacob. One one last fling. 
mind. That the traps? That's the trap, right? So freaking dark. I have no idea where I'm going. And it got super dark over here. Plus, Jacob is taken away, but at least he's with the hunters. I don't know if they're the good. I'm pretty sure they're they're the good guys. I'm pretty sure. I don't know where we going. This before Pop is doing fast, that's it. All right. uh, don't really. God damn. God damn these <laughs> fucking kids. Son, what? Oh! Ah. Ah. Hey, stop! Stop squirming! Give me the trap. You should be, huh? How am I supposed to know? I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Get the fuck away from me! Oh! oh. I think they're honestly trying to help. I don't Caitlin? think. Ryan! Abby! It doesn't feel safe. We can pick up the shotgun shot the shotgun gun that we left. I don't know where she got in the car. If they wrecked that car, it's over. I killed him. I killed him. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. No, you did what you had to. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. I do. No. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Man, this is so fucked. Hey! Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Chris? I'm gonna say, who is he? Who's there? I need your help. 
please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. So? Don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh, yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes? You were supposed to be working, uh... Helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? Uh, you and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her inside. Okay. All right. It could be a trap or it could be her because we know about her and Max. So you know what? Myself, I wouldn't do it, but just to keep the game going. Open the door. Okay. Open the door. I'm going to open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. And she wasn't bit, too. Oh! Here we are again. Just you and me. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Did you look hard enough? These cards aren't just trinkets. You should know this by now. They they can help you. I can help you. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. It's not terribly exciting. Okay, so Nick is gone. I wonder if he could have saved Nick. That's sad, dude. And then Emma's I, I think she's gone too. So because she did get bit. She had a scratch. So I don't know. Why didn't you come? So uh why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Hmm. What's going to happen, dog? Don't do a flashback to what happened to her. She lost her eye, yo. I ain't gonna call out. I want them to pretend I'm dead. Max. 
shut up. You can't just shut up. This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> Name. They'll be angry. I'll... Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Matt? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Bruh. I should be mad, bro. Because I hate his attitude, bro. But. Dude. Alright. I'm going I'm to I'm a, I'm a, Since we're strapped to the chair. I'm going to be plied. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Ah. Uh, why are we going to hack his quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp. And we're broke. Mm-hmm. Man. I could be like, man, that that server doesn't mean a lot. <laughs> I could be like that, but okay, sheriff, hack it. Wait, hack it? Like Chris hack it? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime. Go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? Nah, I'm gonna be angry. Please, will you just stop fucking around with me and tell me what the fuck is going on? What the hell attacked us last night and why did you arrest us, you goddamn maniac? Take me to Max! Break now! What? Okay, I thought I could get away. <laughs> hey. Hey, you asshole. You want to tell us what the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me. Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked... The next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood, and... Stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? Man, dude, you know. Man. 
Maybe at night, that's when they change it, but during the day, they're normal. Huh. I was kind of hoping you could tell me what happened. I feel like I remember bits and pieces, but none of it makes any sense. Yeah, same. I, I feel like... Were we drugged? I feel like maybe we were drugged. By a cop? Do they do that? Who does this guy think he is? Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? I'm gonna be sarcastic, man. He don't like us anyway. I wasn't aware we needed your permission, Detective Dick Whippet. <laughs> yeah, it's a free country, Officer Oat. For brains. Shit. All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey, hey! Let's Get go. the fuck off! Come on. Move. Good boy. Hey! Stop struggling! Hey! Leave him alone! Yeah, leave me alone, asshole. Both of you shut up! Fuck you! I said shut up! Hey! Hey, you can't treat us like this! You're hurting it! Hey! something in here you can use okay i gotta understand maybe the cop been through some shit bro but i hate his attitude so bad bro i don't i just don't like his attitude I hate his attitude so bad, bruh. At least, like, you drug me, right? At least be like, all right, bro, let me tell you what happened, man. You won't believe this. The town of North Kill lay there sleeping. The hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. So another clue, huh? Let me see something real quick. Yeah, we took a lot of paths and stuff. One thing I don't understand, though. Honor. Okay, never mind. I was thinking maybe he's connected because some of these evidence I don't even know. Found some clues. Still missing a couple. But we still got a long game to go, though. All right. I need this. <laughs> that could work. Oh, yeah, this ought to 
do it. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. Is that supposed to mean? Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! Fuck! Hey, how to say are you? Are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? Yeah. You're not acting like... It. I could just be like, reflect. He's not acting like a kidnapper. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever, bro. This isn't forever, Max. Y you can't just hold us here forever. 
You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... Um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I... I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! We've been making plans, Max, what the fuck? I don't know, what do you want me to say? I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great, sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal, you remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was, was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods, and you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your- Goddamn mine? Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like- Zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas.
I could be mean stuff. That was a weird cut, but Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, and you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. So uh, yeah, where will the winter go? The next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot, as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement. What happened to Max? We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna be reckless. I'm not gonna be nice to this fucker one second longer than I have to. We've got to escape. Cool, okay. So how? I don't know. Knock him out? Not... Laura, you know that's kind of a movie thing only, right? I mean, you bang someone on the head, you're more likely to kill them or leave them with permanent brain damage, not just knock them out. Well, what can you do? Yeah. Let's see, so we don't have to knock his brain out. Because the brain is... Man. I, you know what? Cause I don't like him, bro. I just do not like him. So we're gonna we're gonna do prison break. Right, prison break it is. Can we have code names? If we're doing code names, I have dibs on Golden Thunder. No, seriously, Max, we're doing this. Okay. I'm with you. Okay. Here's how it's gonna go down. Next time he opens your cell to take you to get washed up, you jump him. You tackle him down and. Take the keys from his belt, drag him into your cell, lock him in there, unlock my cell, and then we'll steal his car and just drive right the fuck out of Dodge. 
Right. Okay. That's not really a plan, though. You know, that's just kind of saying let's escape, but with a whole lot more words. No, he won't be expecting it. We're in a routine now. We'll catch him in the back foot. Really? Careful. Ah, ah, ah. Really? Genius. But what about my shower? Shh. I said... Take your fucking clothes off! Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him! Come here. Get off of me! Shut up. Have a seat. Stop! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. T, come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Help! Hey, he's got his whole prisoner at the police station! Help us! Who was that? Over. Nothing. On my way. Over. That was pretty stupid. I hate that dude. Hey, you can't just leave me here! Yes, I can. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Well, right. I don't feel so good. Not good like how? I don't know, just... bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch?
So much for depth perception. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Go check him out, Rook. Yeah, I don't like the cop, man. That's why I was like messing with him a lot, man. I'm like, man, fuck you, dude. Literally, all you gotta do is just be like, all right, bro. I'm gonna tell you, you ain't gonna believe this. That's all you gotta freaking do, bro. The animal you just saw, cause they they already seen it, so they. It, it, it's not like they're not gonna be like, wait a minute, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, that didn't happen. No, I freaking, dude, I seen it. Max was on the floor, he was bleeding to death. Ain't no freaking way they're not gonna believe that. But no, the cops gotta be a dick. Excuse me. But yeah, the dog got, the dog gotta be a dick. What's he hiding? So this is when ago, or werewolves and stuff, huh? So maybe the witch is not. I don't know. Maybe the witch did. Like it's kind of hard to even like. Oh, like what? Locked. Figures. And I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping or. I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Nah, I'm gonna keep snooping. I just don't, I don't like to do. One thing to tell me, but why you have to be a dick, bro? I just don't like that, dude. I don't know. I'm putting too much of my feelings into this. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Ah. Uh, that girl. Man. That means he was born in 1965. Look at this room, though. Oh, crap. Messed up. Should have known stuff. But yeah, man, I just, I just don't like that personality, bro. Being a dick just to get you away. I get it. You've been through some stuff. But at least you could at least be like, all right. I know you're mad because I took my ass all the way to the. I shouldn't have. I should have went to the motel, honestly. I should have went to the hotel. There's the needle. This must be what he used to knock me out. I can hide this in my cell. Well, he coming back. I'm about to use that on him. July 7th. Hmm. All right. I think that's it. So every full moon. So every full moon they the they they're able to freaking oh take this door. Oh we checked this in. Oh no we haven't. Whoever was wearing this can't be doing too well. 
Looks like one of the cops got turned and they burned him to death. That's up in here. Crazy though, man. Who knew, man? We were doomed, but where to go? I thought it was more like, you know, like somebody turned them into it. You know, like zombies and stuff. Alright, let's go. Done. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go chill. They said to use that option of, to um, him with the, the juice. Might hit him with the juice. Hey, have you been up here? I haven't been up here. Oh, computer. Hello? Sound like the witch. is a slap in the face. at all but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the mercy of the hag of Hackett's quarry never to be seen again like us except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 blah, blah part we're, we're more like um ghost investigators specter sleuths sure so what happened next well according to reports from the local paper the north kill gazette some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby Yeah, let's get I the hell out of here. This and myself. I need to sleep. Hell out of here. <laughs> Put it. Anne Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. All right, the people that got turned into the when to go the werewolf, whatever. Damn, I feel bad for him. You know, Emma's in the freaking car. So, that's too. But everybody else is okay. Uh, Emma's bad on my part. Probably Nick, too. I, I wish I could have saved Nick. Uh, the worst part is, I think I shouldn't made him kiss somebody. I should never made them kiss. Oh, wrong. I should never made them kiss. Otherwise, there would have been alarm. Definitely gonna be replaying this game soon. Now you believe the wolves.
Yeah, I'm gonna use it on that fool. I just don't like him. I'm just sorry. Go sleep. First of all, I would have closed my cell just in case that food get out. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? Oh, we got unfinished business. You've got unfinished business. Like what? Like how you're gonna tell me exactly just what the fuck is really going on here. Why would I do that? Because I could be halfway home by now. But I'm not. Because I have to help Max. Maybe I can help you too. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. Happy? I'll brew some coffee. Oh yeah, we're gonna use it. <laughs> What's this? An education. Watch. Nice job cleaning up the eye. I mean, it's harder than they make out in the textbooks, especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor, uh, animal doctor, and no, I'm not, and I probably never will be stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know, doesn't mean you know, you know? Uh, what? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're going to have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. Okay, what the hell? No, I'm curious. How is your family involved? So, how is your family involved? My family is down at the bottom of a well. What? Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope, how can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. 
you pull on that rope and you just can fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Right, so you... You're the one at the top of the well with a rope? And... Yes. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Just forget it. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. I'm gonna keep reading. I wanna take the gun. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big F. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. So what? So this is what I'm getting at. So basically, if we kill the person that turned us in the first place, that means we revert back to normal. That is what I'm getting. Like, plus let me. Let me see if she's affected. That's what I'm concerned of. Or why didn't you kill it? Or am I affected? I'm going to just be concerned. So wait, if Max got me in the eye, does that mean I'm infected now too? No. Scratches don't do it. Only bites. Are you sure about that? Pretty sure. Okay. So I could be easily. Oh, I don't believe you, but you know I ain't gonna do it. I'm just gonna be like, okay. So what's the plan? Because he's working with us now. He was a dick at first. That's why I was messing with him a lot. Because I'm like, bro, I don't like your tone. But I'm thinking he's trying to give us a hint, saying, all right, if we go kill the dude that bit him in the first place, what's his name? Uh, Ellen? I N Ellen? If we kill him, then Max will turn to normal again. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter, because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. 
Seen enough? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. Honestly, I'm gonna put down my pride because I do not like him, but... Let's, I'm gonna just say, yeah, I believe him. I mean, it's true. We've seen it and everything, so... Yeah. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's funny. It looks like, um, she looks like that uh, villain from Kill Bill, Volume 2. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. He said, let me in there. Chris! I know they're in there. Who? The townsfolk that didn't show up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. Fucking spit one of them, Chris. What am I supposed to do? <sighs> what was that? <laughs> you shot me. I'm telling Mom. Take your lucky stars it wasn't silver. What's your plan? Can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know. hikers? And that, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we gonna do now? Whatever happened to, we're all in this together. Go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. Max! Uh. Max! Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... 
Yeah, then that's our cure. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow, we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. There you have it. Hey! Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! Uh, Laura? Uh, Laura, are you okay? Uh, God damn it. What the hell is going on? Laura? Uh, starting to think you were really sick well maybe i should consider acting as my major <laughs> i wouldn't go that far <laughs> we should go before he wakes yeah. up We should grab our stuff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. What is it? I thought I heard someone. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. Well, I guess he won't be needing us anymore. Hey. I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> um, I'm not gonna go in the moment. Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going home. And when is that? Tonight. Going to Hackett's quarry. We're killing Chris Hackett. You know, we need to lock him up, though, right? Don't we need to lock up Max? Because if it's a full moon, he's going to attack us, too. I would have left them at the cage. Like, All right, bro, you gotta stay at the cage until I go. Uh. Max at the island seemed like the best place for him. Left Max at the island seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. 
That's it. That's the story. Don't all jump in at the same time. Wait. The island? Like like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, shit. Alright. They're probably fine, though. Honestly, they're not there now. None of them is good answers, dude. Look, it's an honest. They're not there now. Wait, wait. Oh, that's right. They ain't there on our island. Okay. Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. All I know is I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But... I forgot, Jacob's got captured and Emma's back at the car. Now I was thinking too, we have to kill Max in order for Amber to live too. Now that I know. <laughs> um, that wasn't a werewolf. It was Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot. Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless I, I guess it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you then? Wait. Should I show the bite? Or should I hide it? You know, I'm gonna show it. He tried. I got away. I need to end this. We don't have much time. Oh. 
So this is our new gear. <laughs> Smell good, don't I? Go on. Take a bow. Go on. <laughs> Dumb fucking animal. I'm thinking that's me. Let me go! Let me fucking go! Get your hands off me! Ugh. I'm just gonna plead. Please let me go! Okay, I need me for this to happen, please! Please! Oh my god, why aren't you answering me? Oh, 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 is your, is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money. Like lots of it. Oh, yeah. I mean, not really, but you could get some, probably. Please, just let me go, please. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's too, Bobby. Dang. Well, at least Jacob's out the way. He he's gonna be safe. I'm pretty sure. Nosy little rat, aren't you? Poking your nose where it doesn't belong. Don't believe everything you hear. Anyway, here we are again. Let's see what you've brought me this time, shall we? I ain't bought you a damn thing. I'm sorry. Nothing to show, nothing to see. What more do you want me to say? Find the cards or stumble around in the dark. Choice is yours. You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that. As long as you follow the right path, of course. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, okay, Jacob's fine. Emma, that means we have to kill Max in order for Ember. And then Laura, she got bit. Ugh. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Alright. I think I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna end this right here, y'all. <laughs> Look how messed up in the face he looks. But anyway, guys, I hope your day's going pretty good. Please like and subscribe to the channel. That helped me out a lot. Please comment down below. Let me know. Let me know what other games I should play. The next time I'm out, see you.